Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In some pieces, you will find Ubuntu doesn't run properly. When you open your Ubuntu, it shows some error and press any key to continue. If you press any key, it will close automatically. So, what do we have to do? First of all, click on Start menu, search for Turn and open the Turn Windows feature on off. Now here you will have to turn on Windows Subsystem for Linux, Virtual Machine Platform, Windows Hypervisor Platform. Enable these three options, click on OK. Wait a few seconds. Now you will have to restart your PC. Just click on the restart. And whenever your PC restarts, you will have to access the BIOS menu. To access the BIOS menu, you can look at this photo, otherwise you can search on Google. If your virtualization technology is not disabled, enable it and hit the enter key. Now you will have to press a on your keyboard and press the enter key. Your PC will restart again. After doing all the changes in your BIOS and settings, still the Ubuntu is not working. Now you will have to close it in your browser. In my video description, you will find a link. You'll have to open the link. Now here, if you are using ARM 64-bit processor, then you'll have to click on here. And if you are using Intel or AMD normal processor, then you'll have to click on here. And it supports Windows 11 and Windows 10 only. Click on here. Close this ad. The download started. You will have to wait here until the download is completed. Now it's downloaded. Now you can close your browser. Now go to the download folder. And you will find the WSL update. Actually, this will install the new kernel to your system. You'll have to install this. Click on next. You'll have to wait here. Click on yes. The setup is completed. Click on finish. Now, you'll have to restart your PC again. Now, after restarting your PC, open the Ubuntu. Now this time it's installing and it's trying to open itself. Now it's working perfectly. You can see? Now you can see it's done. It's successfully installed on my PC. This method will work for Windows 10 and 11. So if you find any problem, let me know in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.